Hello children! In the previous video, we learned more about 10th through some interesting examples. In this video, we will see some of the misconceptions related to this. Raju and Bablu collected some money and bought an eraser from the market. Raju, let us divide this eraser in two halves. Bablu said to Raju. Okay, let's measure it using a ruler so that we know how long half of the eraser will be. Raju measured the eraser with a ruler. Children, can you tell how long the eraser is? Absolutely right! The eraser is 3 centimeters long. Now, Raju and Bablu saw that half of the eraser is 5 tenths more than a centimeter. Raju immediately said, Bablu, half of the eraser is 1.5 centimeters long. No! Half of the eraser is 1 centimeter and 5 millimeters long. Bablu told Raju. Both Raju and Bablu started quarreling. Just then, Bunny was passing by. Bunny, can you tell us whether half of this eraser is 1.5 centimeters long or 1 centimeter and 5 millimeters long? Raju asked Bunny. Bunny burst out laughing. <laughs> hey, both! Bunny told Raju. Raju and Bablu could not understand anything. Children, is what Bunny said correct? Half of the eraser is 5 tenths more than a centimeter. So we can write it as 1.5 using decimals. And we also know that one tenth of a centimeter is equal to one millimeter. So, five tenths of a centimeter will be equal to five millimeters. Bunny's statement is absolutely correct. Half of the eraser is 1.5 centimeters or one centimeter and five millimeters long. Raju and Bablu split the eraser in half. Children, because millimeter is one tenth of a centimeter, we can write the length of any object in these three ways and it is exactly the same. Children, in this video we learned about some misconceptions related to tenth.